Okay, so with Old MacDonald on page 19, we are ready to do that whole top line. So we start with the first three notes on the right hand. Then we're going to do the next three notes with the left hand. And then we're going to finish the whole line with the right hand, right? So we usually I sing right hand, thumb, left hand, thumb, right hand, right hand, right hand, thumb. So listening again, because I will sing it when I play it at the piano. <clears throat> right hand, thumb, left hand thumb right hand right hand right hand thumb let's see how we go now we're going to do it two different ways for the two students <laughs> the ones that don't mind sharing the thumb with the cat okay they're happy to do that and for the ones that can't stand to have their thumbs on top of each other. We'll separate them. But we'll start with, because this is how the song starts. Okay, so let's try and do it this way. And if it doesn't work, then we'll swap. So remember, the left hand is just going to sit here while we're not using it on the board. And we're going to do right hand thumb. Then we're going to swap. I'll do it slowly. Left hand thumb. Then we're going to swap back. And we're going to sing right hand, right hand, right hand, thumb. Okay, let's try it again. So right hand, thumb, left hand, thumb, right hand, right hand, right hand, thumb. How's that? We'll try it one more time. We'll sing cats this time, right? Right hand cat, left hand cat, right hand, right hand, right hand cat. Okay, now for those who are sitting there thinking, I oh, don't like having my thumbs on top of each other, don't, they get frustrated. So, two black keys, thumb on the cat. Okay, two black keys, thumb on this cat. Let's separate the two hands so they can play. They have more freedom, I guess is the word. So, right hand, thumb, left hand, thumb. Right hand, right hand, right hand, thumb. See, so much easier to swap hands because you're not sharing the key. Right hand, thumb, left hand, Thumb, right hand, right hand, right hand, thumb. At this point in the music, I'm not fussed about the hands being in this position or in this position. I really don't feel it's important. What's important more than anything else is all the finger patterns that we're learning in the song. So whether you're doing it up here or you're doing them together here, it doesn't make any difference. So let's do a separate one more time. Right hand cat, left hand cat, right hand, right hand, right hand cat. And just for the record, most of my students do them separate. Most do not like to have their hands on top of each other. Even though they're your own thumbs, right? Because I say to my students, but they're your own thumbs that are touching. Why do you not... You know, it's not like it's someone else's hand that's on the piano that's touching your thumb. <laughs> but I don't know, there's something about having the two thumbs on the one key that they just don't like. And so we separate them and we play them like that and we just focus on getting the patterns in. So I'm going to do it one more time here for those who do want to try. Remember to keep the left on the board just under the key. Right hand, thumb, left hand, thumb, right hand, right hand hand right hand thumb and that is the whole line at the top of page 19 okay so how did you go with that whole top line of old macdonald at the top of page 19 did you sing along with the right hand thumb left hand thumb right hand right hand right hand thumb sing it every time you play it and then you remember to swap hands as well that's why i sing that song when i do that part so right hand thumb 
left hand thumb right hand right hand right hand thumb <laughs> have fun <laughs>